Hi guys, so today I'm going to be filming a collective haul. So the first thing that I bought was some Topshop jeans. Um, I bought some from Zara, if you guys watched like one of my hauls. I bought some black jeans from Zara but I didn't like the way that they felt and they were too low rise and the material was funny and it was giving me weird shapes and just made me look very odd. So anyway, I decided to um, buy some Topshop jeans. Topshop jeans are not cheap and that's why I wanted the Zara ones because they're much more inexpensive. Anyway, um, so I got the um, Topshop Moto Jamie jeans. So this is what they look like. So they're high-waisted black jeans. And they're in a waist 28 and a length 32. And they're in a size 10, 12 on my bottom. And um, yeah, they're just simple black jeans. I think these retail for about £42. So they're not cheap, but they're literally like, I love Topshop jeans. Whenever I buy a pair, I always feel like them much better quality they're a nice thick material um they last good um i have not washed these yet so uh i'll see how well they fade i went a little bit top shop crazy so the next couple of things are also from top shop i never ever shop in top shop but um yeah i went a little top shop crazy um anyway the next thing i bought was this dress from top shop um and it's just this black dress with a zip that goes all the way down the middle and it's like a croidery material croidery? I think that's what it's called so it's a really really nice winter style dress it also has a belt in the middle which which sold me because I love these kinds of dresses anyway but when it has a belt in the middle and it cinches in your waist it just gives you that really nice hourglass figure and this retails for about £45 then the last thing from Topshop are these um, culottes so i wanted some over summer but then i just could never find ones that i really really wanted and then i saw these um in top shop and they're just black culottes and um they they kind of hit me just below my knee yeah so they kind of hit me just below my knee they're kind of like a you know flowy material and um, they're quite comfortable they're high waisted um yeah and i think these are about 36 pounds so yeah they're not cheap but with student discount um it kind of helps isn't it so yeah then for christmas from my boyfriend he got me this nike um sports top because i asked for this for christmas um i didn't really know what i wanted so i knew that i wanted gym clothes and i hate buying gym clothes because i find them so expensive and yeah so i just thought i would ask for this so just a pink nike top like this and it's got a racer back and it just looks like this and i got this in a size medium so yeah that's what i got and then for my boyfriend's mum i got um i got this adidas adidas top i've actually worn this so um yeah it needs to go in the wash but um yeah so it's this adidas white adidas sports top i don't know if it's going to pick up on the camera properly i'm just going to hold it up so i hope that picks up in the camera properly just a plain white adidas top with stripes down the side and yeah so i've got a couple of gym clothes to wear now i absolutely love getting gym clothes for the gym gym clothes for the gym because um it just makes me even more motivated to go to the gym when I buy myself like some nice new trainers or nice new whatever. It just really, really motivates me. So yeah, talking of trainers, I, I talking of trainers, I also got a pair of trainers from my godmother. So my godmother got me these black trainers from Nike. As you can tell, I really do like Nike clothing. Um, yeah, and they're just I've not worn these yet. They're just these black. <laughs> Just simple trainers, they're nothing fancy, but they're just nice and just simple. They're called the Nike Free 5.0 V2. I don't know if that means anything to you. I think I might swap the uh, orange laces for a black lace. Um, but other than that, I really, really like these. And yes, um, my godmother kindly gifted these shoes to me and I'm very, very grateful for them. And I've not worn these yet, so I'm really, really excited to wear these to the gym. My godmother also got me this little sign and I think this is from Primark. Um, and it's just a home sign and it lights up and it's got bulbs. I've wanted one of these things forever and I've just never got around to buying it. I'm just like, nah, I can't be bothered buying it. And then I... 
Um, then when I opened this for Christmas, I was so shocked. I totally did not expect to get this. Um, I did show her it because we went shopping one day and um, I showed her. I was like, oh, these are really, really nice. I didn't think anything of it. And then she got me, which is so sweet of her. So, yeah, it's just a light up thing. And I think it retails for about £12. My godmother also got me one of these snuggly hot um owls so basically what you do with these owls is you put them in the microwave and it heats up and then it keeps you warm at night and you can snuggle up to it and yeah we use it a couple of times it's actually really good it does give off like a slightly funny smell though i don't know it's like a really weird smell that i've never smelled before but that doesn't really bother me or anything like that so um yeah um and as you can tell you can get it from sainsbury's it says it on there and yeah just, these are so good for winter when it's cold and you know, you want something to snuggle up to. And then, um, I'll show you this. I, from my friend's mum, I got a dressing gown. And this is, I think it's from Next. And it's just a, you probably won't be able to see, but I'll just show you guys anyway. So it's just a purple dressing gown with flowers on there. It's so, so pretty. And guys, it's just so soft. I wore this, like, throughout the whole holidays. And I was just... Just, this is just so soft. My friend, whose mum got me the dressing gown, she got me a Pandora ring, which is so, so, so generous of her. Like, I couldn't believe when I opened this and she was like, I got you a Pandora ring. I was like, oh my God, like, what the hell? Um, I totally did not expect that. It's just so, so, so generous of her. She really didn't have to do that. And it's the Pandora princess ring. And I'd been telling her for a while, I'll just show you guys it. And, and I'd been telling her for a while that um, that I wanted this ring, um, but I didn't want to get it because it's one of those rings where, like, I don't know, it's, it's just one of those rings you don't buy for yourself. Um, so I kind of didn't, I didn't want to buy it for myself. And also, um, I, I find that Pandora stuff are quite... I find that Pandora things are quite expensive and I can never really afford them. So um, so it's so nice that she did that for me for Christmas. I absolutely love this ring. And I'm just going to keep it on because it's so nice. Also, from my boyfriend, he got me the Lancome La Vie Belle um, perfume. And this is another perfume which I'd been lusting over for the longest time ever. And when I worked for Debenhams, I really should have got it then because I would have been able to get my staff discount. But then I just was never, like, I just would always forget and buy other things. And then my boyfriend um, surprised me with this perfume. It is literally, like... The best smell ever and whenever someone else has it on i can always tell I'm like are you wearing la vie belle and it's always like one of those things where i can just straight away tell when someone's wearing it and this is the 50 ml and you also get the body lotion in there i'm really thankful for getting that i absolutely love this perfume it is just gorgeous and it smells amazing and yeah then from my boyfriend's parents they got me this next door stopper so um for ages for my room i um i didn't have a proper door stopper i would use um, a kind of paint that i keep meaning to paint my um i keep meaning to paint one of the rooms in my house but i keep i just never got around to it so i just use a paint pot for the um door stop and they actually got me a little door stop and it's just a little mouse and it's from next and it's just so cute and i really really like it i love presents like this way they're actually really useful obviously i love all my presents but presents where they're useful where you, you can actually use them it's just it just makes a difference isn't it do you know what i mean yeah i love it <laughs> a little random present that they also got me was this little um meerkat family and you can like collect them so yeah it's just a little cute teddy it's so cute and it has a little snail i don't know what that is but i guess it's a it looks like a snail or a i don't i don't know what that is but i know that this is a little baby meerkat and i really really like this as well a little present for myself the only thing that i decided to treat myself to this year um quite an expensive gift actually um i decided to upgrade my phone to the iphone 6 i used to have an iphone 5 but um i bit the bullet and decided to get an iphone 6 and yeah it's just an iphone 6 and this is so much better than my 5 um my phone was so bad and if you want to know what's on my iphone i did it i filmed I filmed a what I, 
I filmed a what's on my iPhone video so if you want to see what's on my iPhone then check out that video and then a little random thing that I picked up the other day because I'd run out of is my Boots Essential Moisturising Cream I really 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 like this cream I have oily skin um, but this is so good because I get quite a few dry patches especially when it's cold outside and obviously you know you want to start with the anti-aging as soon as possible and you know moisturized skin um, doesn't wrinkle as fast so I absolutely love this and I got this for, from Boots for £1.50 and then the last few bits and bobs are just chocolates I've eaten the majority of my chocolate actually I've not actually eaten the majority of my chocolate uh, I've got loads of chocolate to eat and because I'm trying to be healthy it's so hard to you know eat all my chocolate um, but yeah I've still got quite a lot to eat anyway so the first chocolate I got is this Thought Thornton's premium collection chocolate and this just looks like this and I love stuff like this, like picking them out and yeah, so I can't wait to delve into this on my cheat day. And then I also got these Roses chocolate. I love the Roses ones, especially the coffee espresso ones. They are amazing. And then I got some hot chocolate and this is the Whisper whisper hot chocolate from Cadbury's. And I can't wait to have that. I've yet to have it to be honest. I usually dig into these like straight away but i've not even opened it yet and then i also finally if you guys know me then you guys will know that i absolutely love these caramel um waffles and um, when i went to amsterdam they're like a dutch thing like they're so dutch and this is one of the things which i'm absolutely obsessed with they're literally like cinnamon and sugar and waffly and oh my god they taste so good and i think you can get them from like aldi and places like that aldi little do you know like all the all the supermarkets which sell foreign goods um you can sell you can buy these from there and you need to try them because they're so festive and nice oh i just want to eat one right now but there's like 182 calories in one biscuit so i really try not to i don't like to eat these a lot Anyway, guys, so, yeah, that was my huge collective haul. Um, thank you guys for watching. I know it was quite long. Um, I'm going to try to edit it down so it's not so long. Please subscribe, comment, and rate. Anyway, I'm going to go. So, yeah, I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.